Hey guys, Retro Badger here. Hope you're all well. Today we're going to look at a rather interesting Sovereign class. First of all, I want to say a big thank you to MSR1701 for letting me know about this ship. He also fixed the mod as well as I couldn't get it working properly. Now of course we've seen the Sovereign class in British Commander before, but this one has saucer separation. Now we do know, in canon, every single Federation starship with a saucer section supposedly has the ability to saucer separate. We never saw the Sovereign class do this, but we do know it had that capability. I thought it would be an interesting test to put it up against two Romulan de Derridus class warbirds, but we're going to saucer separate. Now this could be tactically a wise move, as I feel two de Derridus class warbirds firing on a single Sovereign class could overwhelm it. However, with two targets to shoot at, that should hopefully split up the Romulan's firepower. Let's go to the battle bridge. Okay, here we go. Oh, look at this, look at this! Wow. Okay, so yeah, that's... Uh, <laughs> that's very pointy, isn't it? It's funny because I've seen drawings before of the um, Sovereign class with its supposed drive section separated from the saucer section, and it is a very, very odd looking ship, that, isn't it? I mean, look how pointy that is! Look at that! I suppose it'd be good, quite good for ramming, wouldn't it, now I think about it? Sir, we are draining their top shield. Now, I believe the saucer section actually has... I, th I think it can fire quantums, I think, even though we just fired one from there. Part of me thinks this saucer has a quantum, but look at that phaser array. Okay, we've got some Romulan plasmas incoming. Oh, looks like we're both going for the same one. Well, there goes that warbird. Oh, they cloaked. Oh, that was dumb Romulan. I remember- Oh no, the deflector! Oh. Sir, we are draining their top shield. It's worse than in Star Trek First Contact when Mr. Worf uh, blew it up. We still have the quantum launcher though. But all is not lost. I'm also going to try and reintegrate. Looks like the quantum launcher is more heavily protected. Ah! Oh yeah, there we go! Look at that! Bye-bye, Warbird. Ooh, time for reintegration. That's it. We got him. Captain. I've never tried reintegrating, so I hope it works. Yay! Yeah, there we go! Tractor beam has been disabled. It reintegrated, and look at that, the deflectors come back. Now I want to see what the yes, saucer sir. section is capable of. So it seems that rather than just being a glorified lifeboat, this saucer section seems quite well armed. But it is the Sovereign... Wow! It is the Sovereign class. It should be. Oh, this is so weird. What do you guys think of the, like, look of it, the design of it? I mean, like... The saucer section to me looks really good, but that section there, the engineering section, it just it just looks so weird. I don't I don't know, I just can't it doesn't sit well with me, the shape. I think I'm just overthinking it, because we've never seen it like that in the show, but the Galaxy Class's Star Drive just looks so refined. Oh, here we go, the Prometheus is multi-vectoring. Doing its thing. I think we should switch to those scary torpedoes. Even the icon there, look at that. It's just the saucer. Now it's weird. I have heard a sound bite whilst firing with this ship, and it's Miguel. 
and he's saying fire at will. Now, could that be saying that when the ship separated, he took command of a certain section? Maybe he took command of the saucer section? I like that. Like, you know, a little bit of thought put into it. Because as we know in the first episode of The Next Generation, Mr. Worf took command of the saucer section. He wasn't happy about it, but <laughs> he still did it. There we go! Well, I'm really impressed with this mod. I am. It opens up loads of new different scenarios, certainly. What do you guys think of it? This mod's currently available on Gamefronts. If you search for Sovereign MVAM, it will come up. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Bye for now.